as far as tipping goes, I think there's a fine line, right? Servers make way below minimum wage. The only way that we make a livable wage is through gratuity, right? So 20% is pretty a good baseline number in my opinion. I just went back to work at my restaurant job and I got stiffed about two or three times, meaning people didn't tip me. I do my best to earn the $2 tip or to earn the $3 tip. I like to joke, you're gonna cover my tip share. I'm gonna force you to like me so much. And while I recognize that serving is not neuroscience, or we're not saving lives, we're just, you know, serving you chicken on a plate, right? It, it's a difficult job. There's a lot of personalities to juggle. Uh, you have to be at the table at the right time, not there at the right time. You have to take care of several different, uh, several different things at, at once, right? And it's kind of a lot. Okay, welcome. What's your attitude about tips in general? Well, I've been doing it for a very long time and I don't expect anybody to tip. I've seen everything. Um, but yeah, I do believe that if somebody gives you great service and they're there and making you feel good and you and your family have a great time, that should be compensated. I think, I think it's a good system. I think people that aren't happy with the service, they just don't have to tip. And like personally, I enjoy tipping people 30 to 40%. It feels good. It's a good exchange when somebody truly gives me kindness and makes me feel good that day. Sure. I think if the restaurant industry were to change and to pay us more, that'd be great. I just wanna pay my bills, right? I wanna to afford to do the things that I enjoy doing. It does kind of suck that it falls to the consumer in order to help me do that, right? But this is the system we live in and you're not doing anything, Walter, to change the system. You're taking it out on me. You could not go out to eat, cook a little ramen noodle at home, right? Mm -hmm. And then this wouldn't be an issue. We wouldn't be here, right? You wouldn't or, get to meet Dr. Phil. Or I could go out to eat and I could just not tip. That's yeah. always an option. That people That's will true. always say that. They're like, well, if you can't afford to tip, you can't afford to go out to eat. I'm like, I, I can't afford it, but I just don't want to participate <clears throat> in it because by paying money, I'm keeping alive a system that I want completely eliminated. And people say, well, like, well, for now, for now, for now. And I'm like, until when? How about I just stop tipping now? I actually disagree with you. You're you're funding the restaurant industry. You're not, you're not hurting them at all. You're only hurting me, right? Mm -hmm. So if you want to affect change, you have to hit the restaurant, not me. You're not doing anything at all. Okay, well, here's the thing is you're hitting back at me now because it's always the servers getting pitted against the customers and it's never directed at the restaurant owners ever because if somebody doesn't tip, it's always the guy who didn't tip was the bad guy. They never turn around and go, hey boss, how come you pay me $2 an hour? So I'm okay with being that guy. I mean, I'm okay I'll, with I'll people I'll give you my boss's phone number if you wanna call her I up and maybe to talk to her boss. about it. But Is you're... your boss watching right now? I hope not. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Yeah. So we'll what see. do you guys think about this? Who's got an opinion of this? Because I, I wanna know, uh -huh, back over here. There was a server at, um, at a restaurant that I went to with my best friend and um, I watched him, I watched him like, play with this kid. It was like a three-year-old kid. It was so fussy, but that guy learned how to calm that kid down and literally in, I kid you not, like a minute, drew the drew a portrait of this kid and gave it to him. So I, I next time I saw him, next time I went to that restaurant, I, I told him, I'm, I'm going to give you a good tip because you're phenomenal. You didn't have to do that, but you did. And I want you to be rewarded for that. Uh, what do you want to say? Our job is like very hard to do. And like before I even ever had a job like I will, will never tip because I never had the money like to give them now since I have a job I always make sure to give out like at least over five dollar tip yeah why do you do it it's because they deserve it honestly if they're having a good day bad day they honestly still deserve it this is like a reward that they deserve you, you chased somebody down one time I did I did that did that like was a four hundred dollar bill it was a four hundred dollar check good, sir and yeah, I chased them down. They were foreigners and they didn't understand the culture. So I explained it to them and then they ended up tipping me. And that situation was just kind of a dream because I got to actually speak my voice. Do you have a story or a question for me? Click the link in the description and tell me what in the world is going on.